Well, MTSU continue to celebrate the 28th annual Salute to Armed Forces and Veterans Day this weekend. Chrissy Parker explains how student veterans are being honored with a Veterans Memorial. 16 known MTSU alumni have lost their lives in battles from World War I to the current wars in Iraq and Afghanistan. The memorial site is simply for students to remember. Still we must honor them. So to our beloved brothers and sisters who are both Blue Raiders and wore the uniform, you will never be forgotten. MTSU alumni, veterans, and Murfreesboro community members came together at the Tom H. Jackson building this weekend. Um, this is a dedication of the uh, memorial of our veterans. Remember what we have out here at this memor veterans memorial for one reason, and that is that it is about protecting our country. The word that was repeated throughout the whole ceremony was sacrifice. It'll always be a reminder of the tremendous sacrifice that our military personnel have had made. Those of us who've been veterans know that it's about sacrifice. It's about being away from your families. This memorial was put here to remind students that freedom isn't free at all and that their fellow students have made the ultimate sacrifice for their country. My boyfriend's son, Corey, um, was killed about two months ago in Afghanistan. He was 21 years old and he was a decorated soldier already. Like one of the girls in the college uh, bought a brick for him. The memorial bricks give family members and friends a chance to honor the ones that they have lost. The men and women who lost their lives for our freedom. We tend to forget what is the price of freedom. We take freedom for granted. To submit the names of MTSU faculty, students, or staff who have died in the line of duty for consideration to be added to the wall, contact Dr. Frisbee at 615-494-8856. Live from the MTSU campus, I'm Chrissy Parker.